Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi and Afghanistan President Ashraf Ghani will hold a virtual summit today. This will be the first virtual summit between the two leaders in 2021. In 2020, Prime Minister Modi held several virtual summits with his counterparts from Australia, European Union, Sri Lanka, Denmark, Italy, Luxembourg, Uzbekistan, Bangladesh and Vietnam. India and Afghanistan share a close relationship. India sent 75,000 tons of wheat, more than 20 tons of life-saving medicines and other equipment to Afghanistan during the pandemic. On Sunday, India sent 500,000 doses of COVID-19 vaccines to Afghanistan. A number of announcements are expected during this virtual summit. The two leaders are expected to sign an agreement on Shatut Dam. The project will provide clean water to 2 million residents of Kabul. This is the second dam that India will be building in Afghanistan. Now, Afghanistan charged the affairs. Tahir Qadri spoke with Vion's principal diplomatic correspondent, Sadan Sibyl, on the importance of today's virtual summit and the relations between India and Afghanistan. Listen. Well, India and Afghanistan, we all know, have a very close relationship. Uh, and on Tuesday, something important will happen. It will be a virtual meeting between the Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi and the Afghan President Ashraf Ghani. And to talk about this virtual meeting with me is the Afghan CDA, Tahir Qadri. Tahir, what will be the key outcome of this meeting? Uh, Saddam, we have been looking for a long time uh, to this uh, great opportunity, uh, but because of COVID and all the restrictions, it didn't materialize. But I'm so happy, and we are all very happy, in fact, that this is happening now, and uh, India will be announcing the, the other biggest project that they have on Afghanistan, the Shotu Dam, uh, because after Salmo Dam, uh, this is the second biggest uh, project of India in Afghanistan, which around 2 million people in Kabul will benefit from drinkable water. Um, and um, if you don't know about Kabul, you know, it is a cosmopolitan city which was initially made for a couple of hundred thousand people, but now more than six million people are living here. Mm -hmm. So as a result, um, this will be a very vital project uh, for the residents uh, of um, uh, Kabul. And the VTC will happen between the, uh, the two uh, leaders, uh, His Excellency the President and Honorable Prime Minister, and the two uh, foreign ministers in presence of the leaders, they will sign the agreement. Mm. Tahir, uh, India has a history of building large-scale infrastructure projects in Afghanistan, whether it is the, the India-Afghanistan Friendship Dam in Herat or whether it's the Afghan Parliament. And now this dam coming up, uh, if you can give us the details about this dam, how it will provide the people of Kabul with clean drinking water. Well, these um, projects are the hallmarks of the friendship and the bond that India and Afghanistan uh, has. Um, and uh, I think I previously have been telling media that India, what India did in Afghanistan was a couple of, you know, things like to say that they believe in Afghanistan's democracy, they built the House of Parliament, to say that they believe in Afghanistan infrastructure, they did the Salmo Dam and now the Shotu Dam is happening. And on the other hand, of course, the sports and, you know, the soft power, the students, you know, the exchanges and, and all that that we have had. So this dam um, comes at a very important uh, juncture of time. And now there is new diplomacy, the, the vaccine diplomacy with New Delhi sending the vaccines to Afghanistan? Well, of course, yes. Afghanistan was again one of the first uh, recipient countries to receive 500,000 doses of made in India vaccines, which has been very highly appreciated in Afghanistan. And this will help us to jointly tackle this pandemic. Mm -hmm. 